you guys. Hope you guys are doing well. I start off your reading with a romance angel message. For those of you interested in a personal reading, you can visit my website at sourcetarot.com. And for those of you interested in learning how to read tarot, my tarot training is down below. So we have stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Okay. So we have past life relationship. You have known each other before. Very soon at the bottom of the deck, clearly decide what you want so it comes to you now. Okay, so for some of you, you may not even know what you want. We have unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. So for some of you, you may be leaving a relationship. Um, or maybe there's somebody here that wants to reconcile things. But I feel like for a lot of you with this unrequited love, you're feeling like it's just not there anymore. The spark isn't there. Um, I do feel also with this past life relationship for some of you, you may be connecting with a soulmate or somebody you just feel like a very strong pull to. So what are the love messages for Aquarius? Okay. We have pets, getting a new pet, giving a current pet new or more love. We have intimacy, sexual chemistry, reminiscing. Okay. Let go here at the bottom of the deck for some of you, you are going to be experiencing um, a separation someone else there is someone in the middle someone trying to sabotage this okay so you could be connected with somebody new but like maybe there's like a third party they have cycles fate karma something ending something beginning fire sign the bottom of the deck for some of you who don't have a fire sign or is there a sag we have earth sign towards Virgo capricorn and we have give it time here at the bottom of the deck um, everything in divine timing let it flow And we have moving, change of residence, moving in with your partner. Fire sign again, the bottom of the deck. Spirit, what are the messages for Aquarius? What is the truth? Okay, so I feel like there could be someone here that doesn't know how you feel about them. They want to know what the truth is. Or of course, this could be you wondering, like, what's, what's going on? Will this ever change? I can't do this right now. Okay. Somebody could be under a lot of stress, under a lot of pressure. I need to hold back my true feelings for you. I don't know where to start. So someone, when it comes to expressing how they feel, they do not even know where to start when it comes to doing that. It hurts so much. I feel like it hurts them to hold it in. The heat between us is so intense. Yeah, it hurts to hold it in for this person. I'm also getting as well, like maybe them not expressing or them not like communicating i feel like that could be like disappointing so now you're questioning like is this going to work is this a thing is this a real connection i do feel like it is a real connection um somebody feels very drawn to you but they're having a very hard time expressing we do have gossip so i feel like this person talks about you or maybe there's other people like if you guys are like friends already i'm just looking at this card all these people together if you guys are already like knowing each other, I feel like there could be people that see that there's a connection, like other people could talk about you guys. Um, no one can keep me away from you. I just got a very specific message. Like maybe some people are like telling your ex, like, oh, I saw them like hanging out with this one person. We have pregnant. For some of you could be expecting. Um, I will never find anyone else like you. Yeah, there could be someone that misses you here. It could be a fixed sign. Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus. What's the other one? Who am I missing? Aquarius, Scorpio, Taurus. What the hell? Why did I just... <laughs> My mind is just blank today. A fixed sign. What the fuck? Why can't I think... Oh, fucking Leo. What the hell? Anyway. Um, I am aware we are soulmates. Yeah. Somebody is aware of this connection with you. I have a crush on you. Instagram hoes. Okay, so maybe for some of you, you have walked away from someone that was entertaining like other people, entertaining people online, and maybe like doing too much on Instagram. I stalk you. Yeah, this person that you walked away from, they stalk you now. watching your social media yeah someone definitely does stalk you and they're very possessive over your body so even if you guys are not together they're like that's still mine 
manipulative. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely getting that here with this card here. It says someone's trying to sabotage this. So there could be a situation to where maybe somebody is aware that you're connecting with somebody else, but they're trying to manipulate the situation. Of course, that's not going to be for everyone. We have Divine Feminine. Divine Masculine. Wow. So perfect match here. Definitely soulmate energy. Past life relationship. And the other person is aware that you're soulmates. They just don't know how to express how they feel. We have Digmatized. So for those of you that have been interested or have been intimate with this person, um, they definitely are very stuck on you. Saving your pictures in my phone. I use you for a place to say, stay. So yeah, for some of you, um, if you're leaving a situation or you're considering leaving a situation, um, this unrequited love energy. Yeah, you could you can feel like this person is dependent on you, this person is using you. Or maybe that's why for some of you you walked away from someone. Maybe they were dependent on you, maybe they cheated. We have cheater here. You're the side chick, yeah. Somebody I feel cheated and you walked away from the situation. Now this person stalks you. Let's take this slow. Yeah, somebody here wants to move forward. Things are moving very slow, though. I do feel that very strongly. Dealing with a cheater. Yeah, for some of you, you were dealing with a cheater. For a lot of you, you walked away from the situation. Now this person is obsessed. They can't stop thinking about you. Pisces. Some of you can be done with a Pisces. I want to hold you. Yeah, there's somebody here that really wants to get close to you block me yeah somebody from the past really wants to come back cheated in the past there is a cheater that wants to come back to you maybe they realized the grass wasn't greener player yeah this person was a player devil energy yeah this person there's a lot of codependency here this person was a player. This person, the devil energy is also temptation. Maybe this person had an issue with temptation. Maybe they were messaging people on Instagram. I feel like somebody here was just doing too much and you walked away. And now I feel like they won't stop leaving you alone. If, you, if they're like popping up in your energy, your dreams, this person is trying to manifest you back. Yeah, fucking multiple women. Like somebody here was very manipulative. Emotional, emotional manipulation. I only want you. Yeah, there's somebody here, though, that really only wants you. Clean, healthy dick. Okay, y'all get this card a lot. There's somebody here that really, really takes care of themselves. Maybe they have a really nice body. They take care of, like, maybe they eat healthy, drink enough water type shit. Like, there's somebody here that's, like, maybe if you have been intimate with this person, this could be your energy here that's stigmatized or vice versa. Somebody wants to express how they feel to you. Do know that this, if you haven't been intimate with this person, do know this person is clean. They do take care of themselves. So nothing to worry about there. I told my friends about you. Yeah, they do talk about you. They gossip about you. I act like it's just sex. Okay, so for some of you that are intimate with this person, they act like it's like, oh, that's all it is. We're just like hanging out. No, this person has feelings for you. Liar. Yeah, they may lie about it. I also feel that they could be lying to themselves. Like, they feel a very strong connection. They are aware that you're soulmates. Maybe they're like, oh, no, it's it's not that. Like... I feel like they discount it a little bit in their head. We have I'm obsessed with you. Maybe they're just unaware of how you feel. So they just kind of discount themselves a little bit. Daydreaming about you. This person thinks about you constantly. I'm jealous of your boyfriend slash girlfriend. Yeah, there could be somebody here. If there's somebody in a relationship, especially if this is a person from the past that wants to come back, I feel like their new person is really jealous of you or the person that maybe they got with them and left them. That person... Yeah, somebody's got, like, it's almost giving evil eye energy. Like, whoever they were fucking with. Attention whore. Yeah, I feel like this is this past person here. You're not even entertaining it. I feel like you're giving them the silent, silent treatment or you're just not entertaining it at all. 
Ooh, sit on my face. Yeah, somebody here, they definitely want to be with you in the bedroom. Okay, so yeah, this person from the past year with all of this energy messing with multiple women, they could be dirty. So do be careful if you are um, still dealing with this person. Gemini, if somebody could be dealing with a Gemini. Taurus. Let's meet up. Could be somebody here that wants to meet up with you, take you out. My man wants you, yes. So this person here, if they left you for somebody else and then now they're single again, they're aware that they want to go back to you. Or they're assuming that they want to go back to you, but they're right. Bisexual. I miss you. Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Me and my person argue about you. Yeah, there's somebody here in a relationship and their person is like obsessing over you because I feel like somebody assumes that like they're cheating on them with you. Like this could be like a friend situation and the friend is like, I don't trust Aquarius. Like I don't, something like that. Group sex, okay. So maybe somebody like suggested this and now their person's like all been out of shape about it. It's just sex. I act like it's just sex. You gotta be dealing with a Gemini. I did get these same messages for Gemini. Um, somebody does just like act like it's nothing, like it's casual, like it's whatever. No, they like you. Let's meet up. Jealous bitches. Yeah, you do got bitches jealousy right now, especially if there's someone in a relationship that they know their man has a crush on you or their woman has a crush on you. Afraid you will reject me. That could be why this person um, has not expressed themselves. We do have half my babies pregnant here at the bottom. So they're, yeah, there could be somebody here that like wants to get you pregnant. Virgo. Capricorn. Spiritual connection. Yeah, there could be somebody here. Strong earth energy. I forgot earth sign came out. So yeah, you could be dealing with the queen of pentacles. Uh, there could be a spiritual connection between you and an earth sign. Baby mama drama. Afraid you will cheat on me. Yeah, somebody here is afraid that you'll reject them, that you'll cheat on them. You know the Queen of Wands here at the bottom of the deck? They see you, I feel like they see you as this Queen of Wands. Somebody very uh, charismatic, very social. Maybe that intimidates them a little bit. We have I Choose You and Gay Man. For some of you, this is going to be a same-sex situation. Uh, but yeah, somebody chooses you. Somebody wants to be with you. They have a very big crush on you. I'm secretly in love with you and we have Aquarius. So some of you could be dealing with another Aquarius. Give me a few more cards, okay. Marry me, yeah, somebody, they can see themselves having a future with you. I want to leave him or her, so yeah. I feel like somebody's wanting to leave their person for you. This could be somebody new or even somebody from the past, like where they, Found out the grass wasn't greener. Now they want to leave them and come back to you. Ignoring your messages on purpose. Yeah, I'm feeling like for a lot of you, that could be your energy. I, I'm definitely getting your giving this past person or this person that was cheating on you or whatever, the silent treatment. You're not even entertaining it right now. Casual sex. Yeah, for some of you, I'm getting a very strong message that something started out as casual. Maybe you both knew what it was. Like there was no nothing. You both caught feelings, or this person has definitely caught feelings. But I'm feeling like it's mutual. With this soulmate energy here, past, past love, and the fact that they're relevant enough to come up in your reading. Uh, I feel like this is very mutual, you and this person. And maybe it started out like it's just sex, and maybe they assume you think it's just sex. But like for them, it's not. They act like it is, but it's not. Spirit, what is the advice? Okay. 
Page of Wands. The Page of Wands, this is an energy of pursuing, going after what you're interested in. Also, pages are messages. So if there's something here that you want to express to someone, advice is to do so. We have the Seven of Cups, Two of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody here is in confusion. Could be you and this person. Queen of Pentacles again here. Uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. I do feel like there, somebody needs to make a decision to come forward with the truth with this Justice card. Some of you can be dealing with a Libra. The world, yeah. It's something, there's a new beginning trying to manifest here. The world, we got cycles. A new beginning is trying to manifest, but I'm feeling like somebody is way overthinking just coming forward. All right, what is the advice? The Three of Pentacles, for some of you could be working, you could work with this person, but also I'm feeling like, well, maybe this person feels like they have to hold back with you. They have the Ten of Wands and the Ace of Cups. It's like this Ace of Cups is trying to manifest here, but with this Ten of Wands, it's like really difficult for this person. So maybe give this person like a, a green light of some sort to so they open up a little bit. This person wants to open up, but they're very afraid that you will reject them. So I do hope that this reading was helpful for you guys. If you would like a personal reading, you can visit my website at swordstarot.com. Also, for those of you interested in learning how to read the traditional tarot deck, my training is down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video.